there have been a lot of girls that have impersonated Madonna and they're all great. Um, a lot of them have come and gone and just did, lost interest or just found it very hard to survive as an impersonator. The one thing I think I have in common with Madonna is looking at something in a business sense because she took her career and turned it into a business and she was, you know, the Madonna we love. She's, you know, doesn't miss a beat. And so I think for me, once I realized I was going to start working, you know, with a lot of big companies and agencies, I got really focused and I start, got myself into dance classes. I got myself into singing lessons. I got myself um, studying her. And in those days we had like magazines we had to look through and, you know, it was like, oh, it old school. You had to look, you know, wait for the video to come on or, you know, and, you know, I got a, I got a choreographer, I put a show together. And then I also just kept reinventing myself like Madonna. You know, I really learned from her along the way. You have to keep going. You have to keep reinventing. You have to keep giving something new. So a new show, a new costume, a new, a new act. And I would always do like whatever she was doing, carry a baby around with me when she had Lourdes or just little things that I could bring to the table to, to make it interesting and entertaining. So yeah, just a lot of hard work and, and really focusing it as a business.